setting up your kontiki. First of all, pass the D-link through the weight and then attach it to the back of the kontiki, making sure to make it really tight, otherwise you're likely to lose your kontiki. That's the last thing you want. So tighten it right up. So once it's firmly attached, turn your kontiki over and then you pass your weight up through the slot. At this stage we're going to put it through the centre slot and then poke your barley sugar through the loop. Then you can attach your line from your sail around the barley sugar. So now you've got the barley, uh, the barley sugar attached to the line and the weight, the line from the sail and the weight. So when the barley sugar melts, the sail drops and then the weight goes straight to the bottom, taking your line down to the bottom. What, what we're going to do here is we're going to steer this uh, kontiki up to the left. This time we're going to attach the weight to that left hand slot and that should steer the kontiki up to the left. Some of you might be thinking, well, how long will it take before the sail drops? Well, there's, uh, you can speed the uh, melting process up, so when you get it in the water, you can give it a good wetting, drag it back a few times and get that melting process started sooner, sooner rather than later. So if you're out a kilometre offshore and you want to speed that melting process up, give it a good tug backwards in the water. So I hope that helps, guys. Happy fishing, and uh, we can't wait to see the photos. Catch you later. Bye.